Alright, well, we're going to try Woody's Roundup Rodeo. Oh, I'm going to check in right here a little bit early and see what happens. And uh, enjoy some Toy Story Land and a little bit of barbecue. Come with us. If you want. Or no, I don't care. Go on to the next video. It's fine. Please stand clear of the doors. Por favor, manténganse alejado de las puertas. All right, so they, they're giving us a few minutes before they check us in. Four minutes, which was two minutes ago. So we probably could go back up, but it's not a big rush. So I don't know much about this restaurant. I've seen a couple of reviews and people seem to like it. Some random dude just said it was good. So I'm sure that's bona fide, a bona fide answer. If you don't use the word bona fide, you should. So we're gonna go in, uh, see what this is about and, uh, and enjoy it. So hang around. And uh, we'll check back in. I tried to use a fake name. They said, are you the, the Stevenson party? I said, yes. Or I said, no, unless their table's ready, in which case, yes, that is exactly who I am. And she laughed and kind of looked around, but then I think it was a party of six, and it was just the two of us slurping down ribs and chicken. Look, roller coaster. Sort of, slinky dog. Look at him go. All right, so next stop, Roundup Rodeo. The bathrooms are going to be towards your left, and you all can follow me. Alright. The butter's a real, uh, I mean, you can taste it when you've had it. You know. This looks pretty fun. Now we'll just have to see if it's any good. Um, so, yeah. All right, so as, as usual, I haven't done a lot of research, <clears throat> but it's okay. The menu looks good. It smells pretty nice in here. Um, hey there, Pepperoni. Uh -oh. here. Welcoming you to the Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Get your wagon, reach for the side. Oh, reach for the side. It's funny. It's full of cheese and sure to please. Stinky dog mac and cheese with a spring in your step. Here is the Roundup Rodeo. Spring. Because Slinky's a spring. So it's it's a family style. And you get a, you get a wiggle in your greens, uh, root and tomato, tomato salad or Wheezy's watermelon salad, which actually I think I do want to try. And then they got some uh, main options, evil Dr. Smoked Ribs, buttercup beef brisket, sausage in my boot, because that's funny, uh, barbecue chicken with style. Uh, and then there's vegan options for Little August. Little August. Uh, combat carl of flour, funny. Scrumptious bratwurst, rip roar and rim chop, all those are vegan and upon request. So if you rub a lamp three times and wish, uh, cedar plank salmon come out. And then you got sides, you just heard about Slinky Dog mac and cheese, cow point corn on the cob, which is a grilled street corn, uh, claw veggie salad, muck and baked beans and potato barrels, which I think are tater tots, which goes well with our channel. Um, and then it looks like you get a choice of a dessert, Bo's lemon blueberry cheesecake, Billy's chocolate soap pie, goat's apple pie, gruff peach strawberry pie, and there's cupcake a la forky if you're a little rider. I'm a big rider. I'm tying my own shoes and everything. So, oh, and then Prospector's homemade cheddar biscuits uh, with sweet pepper jelly. So we'll dig into this, see how it goes. It's pretty, pretty, pretty nice theming. Sometimes I think Toy Story can be a little dino landy a little bit for me. Even though it's totally on theme. But this is cool. Fun lighting. We'll just wait to see what's going to happen when Andy gets here. Looking at the screen again. Up down, up down, up down. Alright, hang on. Enjoy dinner. Drop your lassos and assume your position. I'll about this in three, two, one. Two, two. Well, partners, this year trains reached its final destination. Molly, you're going to bust up the place then. 
Come on, there, little lady. Oh, oh, that's true. I think it's heavy. Well done, cowpokes. Good job, everybody. So, I put the middle of the table. We did it. That's fun. Sandy was here. I didn't record any of that. <laughs> I just did all that and didn't record. Okay, so to recap, for those of you who weren't sitting here live with me, biscuits delicious, dipping sauce it doesn't need, but it's really good. I can't quite like say what that flavor is in the sauce, and I know it, but I can't. It won't. It won't come to me. Um, watermelon salad. It's delicious. Watermelon. It's a familiar flavor, right? Make a little onion on the side. All right. So that's a lot of food. Oh, a little sausage, chicken, beef, ribs, brisket. Oh my! All right, y'all. We get you off to your next adventure. Are we staying together in the same room for the dining plan? Good job. What are you guys off to next after this? Yeah, going to Disney Springs or around the park here? I asked someone earlier, did you get a bucket? It was. Not a good idea for you guys. Snack <laughs> 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 and cheese, not bad either. Nice! This guy's got a lot of energy next to me. Like I respect weekends. that. You remember they did that? I was like... We got classic, sweet, spicy. Did you use any sauce? I mean, that's decent. It's legit barbecue brisket. <laughs> That is a cute little petite sausage. It is. I mean, I've had better ribs, but this is good. Alright. Tuck the fuck out that much food, make it tender and perfect. I mean, it's a big restaurant. And up with all the luck, the greatest of the great white north, the most spectacular daredevil Canada has ever seen. Yes. Ooh, come on. Come on. I don't know, folks. That's a lot of cattle here. Think you can make the jump? No, I think it's just an audio presentation. <laughs> So they brought a ridiculous amount of food. It's more food than any two men should eat. We need, we need the kids here. The problem I have doing these dining reviews is I feel like it's just a camera pointed at me while I eat. And that seems weird. And then I try to intersperse it with like that, you know, a little slow motion video of something. I guess I don't, I don't. I don't know. Those are my worst videos so far. You know what? Um, you know what? I would. I think I would have had more lighting, and I would have had some of this stuff move. Or like, you know, even if the things just spun or moved back and forth, like something to draw attention. Like if you're gonna have Duke Kaboom. Do something to maybe put a little animatronic or something. But I do think it's nicely themed. And the food, the food's great. Have we tried every, what's this? Was there, there was, there was no, was there regular bowl barbecue? Or is it just brisket? Brisket, chicken, sausage. Ribs, which is fine, because I've actually kind of got tired of barbecue in my old age. Out of all this deliciousness, I keep going back to the watermelon because it's so hot outside. Yeah. It's just perfect for... I would like something else to drink. But I haven't seen our waitress. 
I did tell her I like things unusual, though, so I shouldn't complain. I may have set us up on that one. Now, baked beans is something I don't like. I won't eat them. I'm not a particular fan. Charlotte is. Charlotte loves watermelon. I'm, uh... Uh-oh. Come in, Mother Earth. We have a yard sale on the forward territory. I repeat, yard sale on the forward territory. So, clear winners here. The ribs are a little dry, but not bad. And with the sauce, it's fine. Yeah. A little spicy, but not 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 too much. A kid could eat them. Uh, the tater tots are delicious. The chicken's really good. The brisket's really good, actually. Very tender. Mac and cheese is creamy and delicious. The tater tater tots are ridiculous. Yeah, that corn's really good as well. Again, I'm slurping down watermelon, but hot, tired, been on the go since early. Long day yesterday. But I would say, for me, the most spectacular thing on the menu might be the biscuits. We'll never know about the baked beans. Gary, how are the baked beans? Coleslaw was coleslaw. And the tomato salad was good. Everything's good. I'd eat here again. The core is nice. You gotta freeze when Andy comes. The lady outside from Texas probably would not have enjoyed this. And I don't think she'd be wrong. Peach tea was okay. I would like it maybe a hair sweeter. So I got an orange orange soda. Don't tell my wife. I don't know the last, I can't tell you the last time I had an orange soda. What I really wanted was a vanilla Coke. I don't know why. I don't, I don't drink that ever either, but for some reason it was calling my name. They don't have it here, but. Assume your position in three, two, one. Whoa! Hold your horses there, Bullseye. Time for a drink at the watering hole. Sprinkler, all right. It's wild wet rodeo time. Mom, have you seen my swimsuit? Well done, cowboy. Thank you, thank you. We did it again. It's unbelievable. But perfect. All right, and then for dessert, we got, which I can't even believe I'm putting in my mouth, is a lemon blueberry cheesecake. It's pretty good. I wouldn't say I saved room for it. But I'm going to try to make room. One up sweet. So it's a good meal. Um, it's a lot of food. It's a lot of food. Although, hey, they complex their food. So that's nice. So all the stuff we didn't eat. What was this? Strawberry peach pie. Strawberry peach pie. Oh, that's good too. Yeah. So dessert was good. Biscuits are huge winners. Like them. If I'm coming here again, I'm coming for the biscuits. So it's good to know at a Disney restaurant that they actually do compost all that stuff. I didn't know that. I love it. Four out of five here? What do you think? Four out of five? Four out of five. Solid four out of five. So I like that. It was fun. It's not an every time, do it every time kind of restaurant, but it's, it's pretty cool. Oh, it's brighter over here. We were in kind of a blue section. Biscuits were incredible. Everything was pretty good. So if you uh, have a great night. Thank you so much. But yeah, it wouldn't hurt my feelings if the kids said, hey, let's go to Woody's. Have a little barbecue. So that's it. Stick around. More cool stuff to come. Here's some uh, Toy Story Land to finish your night out.